Alright, tonight I'm going to unbox and install the Pack Mule cargo carrier. Uh, it's a hitch mounted, all aluminum, tubular uh, cargo carrier for the back of your truck or SUV. Really good tool for carrying coolers, gearboxes, camping stuff. It's really light. I mean, I think it weighs in at a little over 40 pounds and it's supposed to have a capacity of over 500 pounds. That's it. It is a uh, two inch aluminum hitch. This is a lot lighter than my last unit, uh, and it feels stronger. As you can see, the whole frame is tubular. Pretty easy. Got a hitch pin lock. Looks like fun. Information on the back. We have installation instructions and lock instructions in case you don't know how to use that. Sweet koozie, everybody likes those. Sticker, pretty strong. This is one of the reasons I bought it. My previous cargo carrier had a regular bolt with a little pin that goes through it on it and you drive down the road and all of your stuff would be wobbling. I guess that's fine but Pack Mule makes a bolt that will screw into the hitch, the tongue, not the receiver. And comes with a lock. Maybe I should read the instructions because I clearly don't know how to use the lock. Alright so Washer for the bolt end. Uh, really nice cover on that. And I like that even if you don't have the key in it, you can just slide it on and it clips into place and it's locked. So you really only need the key if you want to get it off. That's nice from a theft standpoint. Uh, it's an expensive cargo carrier. You're paying for how light it is, how strong it is how it doesn't wobble. Pretty heavy duty steel. Uh, I like it. While we're here, I just want to show you a tool that I always leave in my truck. This is the Craftsman. They call it a demolition wrench. It's pretty great. It's got a hammer on it. Obviously a adjustable wrench. With, looks like standard and metric. Nail puller. Really nice unit just to have in my truck. Uh, and it's going to come in handy for this. One of the things that are on the instructions of the pack mule is that you should use a, a socket, a 7 8 inch socket. I'm going to put that to the test. It does say to hand thread it. It's pretty great. Now's the real test. Pack Mule says this thing is rated for 500 pounds. We're going to try it with just a bit under 300. And that's impressive, y'all. I'm pretty sure my previous one would have slipped over. That'd be the end of it and maybe me. This is a great unit. A little pricey, but uh, I'm, I'm real happy with the way it looks. Can't wait to get it tested. Took the first trip with the Pack Mule cargo carrier. Came out to the ranch with a uh, extremely heavy cooler and some gear boxes on it. I was so impressed with the way this thing rode and I wanted to take a minute just to show y'all a little bit more detail on this thing because 
there's no getting around how expensive this thing is, but I really feel like it's the last cargo carrier I'm ever going to have to buy. I love that these things are made in the USA. Uh, I love that they're uh, designed here in Texas. Uh, everything about it is just complete quality. Extremely impressed with it.